Rice Robotics is an autonomous service provider, creating both the intelligent hardware and software required for next generations of corporations to deploy robots at scale. We are trying to create the Service Robot 2.0 where we are encouraging human-robot interaction. All of our robots are equipped with the same core technologies that make them great. The first would be crowd navigation. Our robots are really good at moving around people. And the second would be all the local integrations we are able to do. Because of the entire hardware and software stack being owned by the company, we are able to customize based on our clients' needs. And the last and most significant core technology that we are trying to build is the robot interaction module. We're trying to allow robots to communicate with humans in a more effective and intelligent way. Our current product line includes three different hardware products and a software product. Rice is an indoor delivery robot. We also have Jasmine, which is an indoor sanitization robot, allowing it to disinfect the air around us. And then we also have Portal, which is a multi-purpose patrol robot that allows it to do security and concierge functions. We are soon launching our fourth robot, Pearl, and it will be a air purification robot. We also have a software product, which is called Rice Core, and all of our robots interact with this cloud fleet management platform. So we are a company that started in 2019. At the time, we aimed to create the most intelligent service robots. But the one problem that we really wanted to solve was to help out the entire COVID situation. We saw that there was a need to reduce human-to-human -human contact, and that's how Rice and Jasmine were born. So on a practical level, we've seen a huge demand for our robots, especially since our first deployment at a quarantine hotel with Rice delivering food to the quarantine guests. And then we have Jasmine constantly disinfecting the air in malls or even in super terminal, disinfecting all the cargo that goes through that space. As of now, we've actually already deployed 200 plus robots in the market in all prime locations over the last year. We are trying to create the most intelligent and friendliest robot in the world.